Well, this week I need to do some repairs on the runners of a cutter sleigh. A couple months ago, I had a video that showed the process where I steam bent new runners. Well, this cutter sleigh doesn't really need a complete new set of runners, but it does have a rotted section in it between the front and the middle strut that the owner would like to have replaced while preserving the rest of the runner. So this week I'm going to show the process of what that takes. Slays are kind of a uh, finicky type vehicle to work on. They require a lot of labor because they are very intricate. Everything is curved and bent. And so they just take a lot of time. So oftentimes a sleigh can absorb more expense than really what they are worth. It's just one of those vehicles. They're kind of a courier knives type of deal. They have a romanticism about them. But practicality in the land and the times that we live in, the roads are plowed and they just really aren't a practical thing, but they are a romantic vehicle. So anyway, this week we're gonna go through the process of what it took for me to repair this one runner on this cutter sleigh undercarriage.
Well, you can see it's kind of an involved process when I do a patch job on a cutter runner. You know, I try to incorporate the joints to where they are reinforced with the iron work that's in the sleigh. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this process. Thanks for following along, and as always, thanks for watching.